Welcome to War Thunder with Jordark. Uh, obviously, I play this game a lot, don't I? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but that's okay. Well, I'm back here on War Thunder, this time in aviation battles. But it's still arcade, so. Uh, I don't have the capabilities yet of playing a simulator or. I, I don't think I've even tried to get into realistic battles. I haven't tried them yet. And maybe after this one I can try realistic. Yeah. No, but uh, I might try it. It's, it sounds cool. Doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, we're going to go ahead and try an air arcade battle with my Royal Air Force. But I promise I'm not Australian. And I am, in fact, a British pilot of the Royal Air Force. I okay. No, at least for today. No, because uh, I have a great American uh, air fleet, but they're currently filled up with tanks. So I'm going to spend my time expanding my British Air Force, because there are no British ground units yet. It is only German, Russian, and American. But hopefully soon we can see some... Uh, some Churchill tanks and stuff rolling over the gate great plains of Poland is ridiculous as that sounds alright and we're going out in the gladiator I know I've got a hurricane over here which is a, a 2.0 and the gladiator is a 1.3 but let's start out in the, why not why not right yeah. okay. I don't have any bombs see that no bombs I know you could have just looked up under my speed but hey whatever now, I did reduce my settings to high so I could record this in full 60 frame rates. Because I was experiencing issues with the game recording at max settings only going to 40 frame rates, so I reduced it. Now, who am I going to try and attack? Because I'm going to die after I try. Let's dive on that HE 51. Okay. We're going to let them thing, because I have yet to know how to change it around so that I can look around without moving my camera. Let's go for that F4F. There's a, oh no, JU-87, let's go with that guy. He just looks like he's going in for, for ground units over there. Alright, boys. Batten down the hatches, even though this isn't a ship. Yeah. Now, I, I do very, I can do funny things sometimes, but uh, right now, not so much. That uh, hurricane or the JU, which one's a better turn? I'm closer to the hurricane, but I'm not as good as a match. You know, this game is less about, it's more about skill than anything, but, I mean, it is arcade mode, so. Did, did he die? Whoa, 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 whoa. And made our collision like a couple idiots. Awesome. Alright, let's bring out my hurricane. Do I have any... Oh, I do. Omnipurpose. Stealth attack. Tracers. Eh, yeah, let's do omnipurpose. I'm not very sure about it, so... Meh. Where to go to next? I see your target up high. Ooh, there's somebody back here, though. Where is he? Where is he? Is he way up high? No, he's down low. Let's go get that, that F4F over there. I have a feeling he's attacking our base. My base is mine! My base is not yours! Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, good hit, good hit, good hit, good hit. And I'm dead, I'm dead. Okay, I'm good. I forgot how I thought this thing was. Come on, gotta get that wild. Yeah! Got the wild cat. Man, I forgot how fun this could be. I have not played the air units in quite a while. Or air forces, or... Air arcade, I don't know. Aviation battle. I haven't done an aviation battle in quite some time. 
All right, boys. We got more enemies to kill. That HE 111. Let's go after him. He's fighting our guys. Let me at him. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, got him. Knocked his pilot unconscious and rescued another fighter. Alright, he's on fire. He's gonna go down. It looks like a fuel fire, too, so... We're not gonna mess with him. That's somebody else's kill. Alright, who's next? What? Man, I could have swore he was going to go down. Yeah, he's down now. There. Tail damage, you're not going to get out of that. Yay, he's dead. Eh, I got a couple points off him. I thought he was dead the first time, though, and he still managed to do some crap to me. Alright, we're going to try and go after his HE-51. Never mind, he's dead. I'm gonna go after the the, the Blenheim. Let's go after that Blenheim. Come on, buddy. Come on, guys. Let's go get this Blenheim. He is going after our ground units. It's a fair fight, right? Gotta reload. Recording. Be there in a minute. I do. I'll make one. Okay, come on. Let's do it. There he is. He's still strafing those guys. Go back after that Blenheim. And I'm dead! But I did quite a bit of damage in that one! Yeah, and I killed somebody else! Apparently. Awesome! Okay, let's do the... Do we want to do the swordfish with the bombs, or do we want to do the Blenheim? Blenheim does have a fortifying machine gun. The Bay of Fort doesn't. Let's go with the Blenheim. Two, four 250 pound bombs. Let's do this. I don't think I have a choice to... Yeah, I do. Aw, oh, man, I should have chose. Let's do it, boys. You only have six ground units left. Awesome. Ground forces, go! If I have my... I believe with my flaps in combat, I'll drop quickly. But I'm completely guessing.
The Blenheim is actually extremely agile for some unconfirmed reason. And it has its own machine gun for the pilot to use, which is awesome. We won! Yeah! Mm. That's right, for queen and country, man. For queen and country. Yeah! That's right. That's right. Now I gotta buy upgrades. Well, that was a good battle. Alright, that one's definitely getting done. Oh, well, thank you so very much for tuning in again today. Uh, my name is Jordark, and this has been War Thunder with Aviation. See you guys next time.